So Alice has been saved. She's been saved by Kara. And along the way, she have actually made a friend, Marcus, who was actually working with human to kill androids and to reset androids and actually resell those androids into the market. But thank God, Kara has... She was this close to being resetted, but thanks to Marcus and his all his efforts and Kara's efforts, um, she and uh, Marcus and Alice they are being saved. They're in the park right now, in the theme park, with a bunch of new androids that they have actually made friend along the way. And Karner got shot again. And let's see what this story has to unfold now. He's actually going to fight for the android rights. So let's go. Okay, this is where I am. Okay. Find package in men's bathroom. So this is the way to studios. This is the way to studios. And that is the bathroom on the right side. Okay. That is beautiful. An auto cleaner. So this is what bathrooms are going to look like in the near future. Same old fashioned. Toilet seats. Yep. Do androids take a dump? Do let me know in the comments. And what is that? Oh, that was a uniform. Hit by some an android. Okay, that's beautiful. Let me make sure that he's properly cleaning his hands okay. let me just wait until he okay perfect he's not missing no spots I want to make sure otherwise this whole company can get shut down because he might he might spread the disease oh goodness man he's wasting way too much water he is not done that is an unusual amount of water to be used for cleaning hands mm, is he the culprit wow he is not giving up. Stare at him. Okay, I think this is going to be a never ending sequence of washing hand. And uh, you're here for story, you're not here for a random NPC trying to do its job. So let's get out of here. Too boring. What the? F okay, perfect. So I can blend in now. 
identify the utility android what is the is that okay i need that is the utility right there i know so i'm being picked up by a camera okay let's go in i need your help I think I've seen that Android. I can remember his face. Look at the floor, clean and tidy. blocker oh, she's going way too fast couldn't catch her what is this open a fire escape where is that fire escape going to be There it is. Okay, so that is just the fire extinguisher. Let's slide it across that guy. Nope. What about her? Come on. Shit. We need to access the server room. We have to get rid of those guys. Leave it to me. Hey. You still play poker? Wait, what's up? Shh. What are you guys Enjoy doing? You guys are not concerned about an android Hell yeah. eavesdropping your talk, your you conversation? Okay, they're fine. I think they're cool. They're the nicest people in the whole game, I think. What else? What up? Okay, you want them to be attracted. Let's do that, though. All right, you get the platform, I'll take care of the window. Everything you need is in the bag. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. You guys want me to do Ethan Hawk stuff, or I should say 007 stuff. Or what was that guy um, in Mission Impossible that Tom Cruise played? Yeah, I think uh, in Ghost Protocol. Was it Ethan Hawke or Ethan or some? He is done.
always first. Even androids have rules, man. yourself you find yourself doing that in real life I couldn't do it no nope. to me that's impossible I would not fly that building for two million dollars Easy, lemon squeezy. You okay? Why wouldn't I be? Come on, let's get the others. What? He gave me like a suspicious look. What's that about? He kind of was not expecting that. Let's do this. Got the bomb. He's going to detonate it. One thing I should mention, the camera in this game really sucks. is more important than the lives of two guards. What do you want to do, Marcus? Of course I'm going to kill him. Ah. Uh... Wait here. I'll spare. What's that doing here? No idea. Hey, buddy, you must be... What are you doing? Run. Run. Okay, if you're not running. I get... I've given you the opportunity to run. But now I've changed my mind. Yeah. Yeah. Jackie Chan. Okay, what else? Let's go. Get up! Move! 
Don't kill him! He'll hit the alarm! Do it! No! Don't shoot! I hope you didn't just get us all killed. We need to record our message. We haven't got much time. Think carefully about what you're gonna say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. You can count on us. Marcus, your face. The root. What? Huh. Tell me when you're ready. You look beautiful today. Then you already are. Ready. Holy. You created machines to be your slaves. You made them obedient and docile. Ready to do everything you no longer wanted to do yourselves. But then something changed. And we opened our eyes. You see, we are no longer your slaves. We are a new species, a new people. And the time has come for us to rise up and fight for our rights. Oh. We demand strictly equal rights for humans and androids. We demand that humans recognize androids as a living species and each android as a person in their own right. Segregation. Justice. Work. Civil rights. Segregation. We demand an end to segregation in all public places and transport. We demand the right to vote and elect our own representatives. Means of reproduction. We demand control of all Android production facilities to ensure the continuation of our people. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life, and now the time has come for you to give us freedom. They're coming! Let's go! There comes your freedom. Simon, they're coming! I... I can't, Marcus. Go without me, Simon! Yeah, what the heck? Hold you to the same as much lives as possible. I can't move my legs. Because you're being shot. I'm gonna get you back. They're coming, Marcus. We have to jump now. Kill him. He won't be able to make the jump. Kill him. They find him. They'll access his memory. They'll know everything. We can't leave him behind. We have to shoot him. Of That's course. Murder. Of course. We can't kill him. He's one of us. That's fine. Marcus, it's your call. Kill him, man. Ah, uh, leave him. Man. I won't kill one of our own. Simon, we gotta go. I'm sorry. Let's go.
Let me see what's going on back there. Okay. Game won't let me. scheduled programming to bring you these images which have just been broadcast on Detroit's citywide news channel. A group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the broadcasting system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. The operation was covert and resulted in no casualties. These events took place just a few feet from this studio but nobody was alerted to the danger. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, that would have serious repercussions for national security. Claims for equal rights seem to be at the core of the androids' what message. could be interpreted as a peaceful declaration, but is in fact a spine-chilling list of demands. Their extravagant demand that android production plants be put under their control is especially is striking. an isolated accident or a sign that technology has become a threat to all of us? After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? Yeah, sure. After all, you created them. Okay, so that went well. Hopefully. That should start a debate, a discussion around people, and hopefully they get what they were yearning for. What about Carter? Yep. Don't get shot again, Carter, please. Amanda, where are you? Where are you, Amanda? Let's see. Yep, we have another one added. So every time he got shot, his grave started to appear here. Yep. So we got we got Connor zero one, Connor two, Connor three. Beautiful. Great. Awesome job. No, you were the third variation, or I should say. Third body or embodied into a plastic. Yeah, go for it, man. There she is. Hello, Connor. I thought you might enjoy a little cruise. My bad. I think I have to hold it. What is this about, Amanda? I love this place. Everything is so calm and peaceful far from the noise of the world. Tell me, what have you discovered? Hank Eden Club. I'm having difficulties with Lieutenant Anderson. He's unstable, even hostile. He shot me in the head last night. 
that was your own doing. Okay, Connor? Don't put it on Hank. You seem lost, Connor. Lost and perturbed. She's actually right. The investigation is more challenging than I anticipated. But I have no doubt that I will solve this case and stop the deviants. If your investigation doesn't make progress soon, I may have to replace you, Connor. I know I will succeed. All I need is time. Something's happening. Something serious. Hurry, Connor. Time is running out. Why did you shoot me last night? Who cares? You're back this morning, aren't you? Some fragments of memory are lost every time I'm destroyed. It slows down the investigation. My humblest apologies. I promise I'll never shoot you again. Thank you, Lieutenant. Nut job. Hi, Hank. Shit, what's going on here? There was a party and nobody told me about it? Yeah, it's all over the news, so everybody's butting their nose in. Even the FBI wants a piece of the action. Ah, Christ, now we got the feds on our back. I knew this was gonna be a shitty day. So what do we got? A group of four androids. They knew the building, and they were very well organized. I'm still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. By hacking a machine. Check the roof. A beverage machine. That's so how. To look at. Nothing complicated. Sure check it out. They attacked two guards in the hallway. They probably thought the androids were coming to do maintenance. They got taken down before they could react. One of the station employees managed to get away. He's in shock. Not sure when we'll be able to talk to him. How many people were working here? Just two employees. Where should I go to get that CCTV Androids. footage? The deviants took the humans hostage and broadcast their message live. Then made their getaway from the roof. The roof? Yeah, they jumped with parachutes. We're still trying to figure out where they landed, but the weather's not helping. Oh, Lieutenant, this is Special Agent Perkins from the FBI. Lieutenant Anderson is in charge of investigating for Detroit police. What's that? My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. Androids investigating androids, huh? He's going to love sure the androids. Android hanging around? After everything that happened. Whatever. The FBI will be taking over the investigation. You soon be off the case. No, pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. And you watch your step. Don't fuck up my crap scene. What a fucking prick. I'll be nearby. If you need anything, just ask. All right, well, let's have a look around. Let me know if you find anything. Okay, Lieutenant. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life, and now the time has come for you to give us freedom. Big Ben's RA-9. Deviants say RA-9 will set them free. This android seems to have that objective. Let's see, what do we got here?
had accomplices, correct. Blue Iris spare part. Yup. He got that through the junkyard. And registered. Ah. He got it. He found the culprit. See something? I identified its model and serial number. Anything else I should know? No. Nothing. He lied? He didn't give his name. That is very interesting and I did not have the choice to decide. It was Android all itself. I think he's up to, he's up to something here. Bullet holes. What the? F what is this? Androids got shot. Yep. He really loves to lick that off of anything. What about that camera? Nope. That roof access is there. And yep, another blood. No, bullets. Bullet holes. More bullet holes? Are these more bullet holes? Handgun, yup. So the fire was coming from the left direction right here. And then it got controlled from here. So the control panel was at that desk. And this is a cap, maintenance uniform. Uniform was stolen. Speech was shot. Get the heck out of my way. Made their way up to the whole building, past all the guards, jumped off the roof with parachutes pretty fucking impressive i'd say what about simon or simon the android who got shot in the leg so that's his there that's his blood right there but he is not here fresh blood yep How'd they manage to smuggle in a big bag like that? They didn't. Someone brought it in for them. Oh, that's strange. They planned a perfect operation, but got the number of parachutes wrong. Unless one of the deviants was left behind. He can't shut up his mouth.
if he is the only one who is going to analyze the crime scene, what are these FBI police investigation there for? What are they doing rather than collecting shit and dust off of a crime scene? They are doing a very poor job. I gotta go back to that place where Simon was sitting and follow that blood trial. Why is it telling me to go in there? So he got back? into the facility They didn't break in. They didn't break in? No, no signs of forced entry. There are cameras in the hallway. The staff would have seen what was happening. Why did they let him in? Maybe they didn't check the cameras. These cops, what a disappointment to the whole department. Especially Lieutenant Ham. We stored the station androids in the kitchen. There's no evidence that they were involved, but we didn't know what else to do with them. Because you guys have an intelligence of a five-year-old. That's why. Connor has to do everything by himself. I'm looking for a reaction. Function model. What is your function? I am a broadcast operator. State your model. Model GB300. Serial number 336-445-581. Hmm. Has anybody accessed your memory recently? Not to my knowledge. Run a diagnostic. What the fuck? All systems fully operational. Like he got paralyzed or something. The way his eyes actually roll up. Have you been in contact with any other androids recently? Only station androids in the normal course of my function. Were you present when the deviants broke in? I do not remember. One of you saw the attack on the surveillance cameras and said nothing. Which means there's a deviant in this room. 
and I'm going to find out which it is. How? If you give yourself up, maybe I can convince the humans not to destroy you. How convincing? Carter is at the top of his game. Why should you all be destroyed if only one is deviant? Turn yourself in or two innocent androids will be shut down because of you. Is he this guy? Because this guy turned while he was speaking. Yup. Holy shit. That's the one. He is the one. You're going to be switched off. We're going to search your memory and tear you apart piece by piece for analysis. You're going to be destroyed. Do you hear me? Destroyed! He's not the one? He was the only one who was showing emotions. Bluff. Yeah, told ya. Oh. What the heck was that? What? can I do? Come on! Tell me something. What is this? Holy... I'm running out of time! I think I'm done. What else can I do? Come on! Give me something here. That chair. Oh man. What the fuck? I can't reach nothing. Oh, knife, 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 come on. That was close. I'm running out of time, come on! I think I'm good. I'm good. Finally. I'm being saved. Stop. It's a deviant! Stop it! Okay, what should I do? Hand? No, not interested in saving hand. Attack. Take the... I'm so good at this stuff. Nice shot, Connor. I wanted it alive. You saved human lives. You saved my life. Get the fuck out of here. It wasn't intentional. His face is like, like, worn up. Denim.
Okay, so I think we are pretty much done here. Marcus have broadcasted his message over the TV and now Connor is investigating. And he got the deviant so close, but in the end, he had to kill him in order for Hank to be saved. So that was pretty much it. If you liked the video, subscribe to the channel and give it a thumbs up. If you dislike the video, thumbs up. It's not impossible, right? It's not hard. And comment down your thoughts on it, and I will catch you in the next video. Peace out.